Hi there, I'm Anastasia Surridge. I'm a Zazzle Pro designer, and today I'm going to show you how to remove a, an image that's on the design that you're looking at that you don't have access to, um, that the designer has placed on there. So in this case, I'm going to show you how to remove one of these little icons down here at the bottom, but it could be a floral graphic, it could be a background, it could be anything that um, the designer has placed in that particular um, product. So to do that, normally you go personalize this template and under details, when you click the details, you would add or you would just backspace over the placeholder text in order to personalize the design for yourself. In this case, we need to just go a little bit further and we need to click here on click to customize further. See it's blue, so it's a link. So click on that and that will open up the Zazzle design editor for you. That's where you need to actually be to access this. So um, I'll just resize my page here because I've got a separate video recording area here. So we're actually in Zazzle. There we go. That shows it a little bit better there. And on the left hand side you can see a number of layers. If you've never worked in layers before, layers are actually one individual element and they're all grouped together to create the final design. So there's, in this particular product, you have two areas you can design on. You have the front and you have the back. So what you do is you open up the area that you need to open up to go into. In this case, it's the back of the card and let's say that you want to remove the Pinterest button, for example. See here, if you look at the little icon or the thumbnail, you can see that these are all of the little social media icons in this group. Unfortunately, we can't name groups at the moment. That would be handy if Zazzle does update this feature so that we can do that. But all you need to do is click ungroup at the top, and here you'll see each individual listing. So this is the Facebook. It's a PNG, which gives you a clear background. We've got Instagram and we've got Pinterest as well. So let's say you're getting rid of Pinterest. There's two things you can do. You can hide it by clicking on this little icon here for the eye and it goes away. That's the easiest thing to do. Then click on Facebook, press down the control or command key and at the same time then click on Instagram and all you now need to do is center this particular, or center the remainder or adjust the remainder till they're in the middle. So this has a center line to the section here. So we can turn on grid lines and get an idea where of that is. So in this case, it's right about right in the middle of these two grid lines. So if I take these two um, layers here and I can just then click on the layers in the editor and move them across slowly till they're where I want them to be. And that looks pretty much centered. Now I just release the click on the mouse and it's done. You could do the same thing if you wanted to let's say enlarge this design. You can come back up here. That's the circular floral design behind the logo. Over here on the right you've got scale buttons. You can click up to scale it up. or down. If you make a mistake, just click Control Z. Z. Excuse me, I had to just pause that while I sneezed. In the meantime, I pressed Control Z while I was sneezing, so you may have noticed that it um, actually changed size there. So that's how you can remove a particular PNG image or a JPEG or something like that from the design. So when you're done with that, just click Done up here. And once you've edited all of your personalized fields here under the details, when you're ready to order it, just go add to cart. If you've done that and you can't get back to ordering it at the moment, it should save under your saved design. So if you come up here where, and click on, click on your little you know, icon for you under save designs, that's where you'll find it. And you can come back to it later. Okay, I hope that helps you. Thank you.